<laughs> it's been wet. All it's been day. Oh. The most of the weekend Ooh. was. Even. Yeah, no kidding. Yesterday, I did get the lawn mode on Saturday. Oh, man, good for, good for you. Before everything started up. <laughs> man, boy, this week, it's going to be rainy, dreary. Wait till you see the weekend. Uh, 50s will be the afternoon highs. Oh, oh why this weekend? I know. Oh, right. oh no. Uh, <laughs> here comes the cold weather. Boy, it just came right in, didn't it? 50s is where we stand right now. Only a couple of low 60s out there compared to 24 hours ago. Oh yeah, you can feel the chill. Three to five degrees, eight degrees cooler than this time yesterday, Friday Harbor, uh, six degrees cooler in Seattle. Rainfall totals, these are uh, some of the sites around Western Washington, Port Townsend. Look at that number, six tenths plus. Uh, uh, Quileute about four tenths or so. Port Angeles, almost a little more than three tenths of an inch of rain. Also North Bend got about uh, 1.15, two tenths for Clallam Bay and Wishka about uh, two tenths of an inch of rain there. So we do have a couple of lingering showers right now. Uh, we're almost done with with this what came through this afternoon was a warm front. It's passed so behind it just to get a couple of scattered showers. A lot of that is right on the coast, but boy, that gray is just going to be with us for a good part of the day uh, tomorrow as well. Light scattered showers, Marysville. Uh, most of this coming to an end right now, but again, we do have some light showers shoreline to Seattle, but you will still uh, have some of that water on the roadways tomorrow morning. A few light scattered showers, mostly cloudy throughout the day. We will get more rain late Wednesday, and we're gonna, just going to keep that chance going all the way through Saturday. This weekend, we were talking about cooler air. Yeah, we are going to sit with 50s for afternoon highs. So, Futurecast, 8 o'clock this evening. A lot of this has moved out of here. Boy, the clouds just keep coming. Uh, 7 o'clock tomorrow morning, mostly cloudy and perhaps a couple of light scattered showers. No green popping up on the radar here for Futurecast. However, there is enough moisture lingering around that we could just squeeze just a couple of light scattered showers. Shouldn't amount to a whole lot, but you can see as we go through 630, boy, not a whole lot of sunshine. Not a very bright start to fall, of course. It's just gray. Uh, Wednesday, we continue with some more in the way of cloud cover. A short break during the afternoon to get a little bit of sunshine. And then by the time we get to 5 p.m., perhaps a few light scattered showers. And it looks like we'll keep the chance for those scattered showers moving overnight into Thursday morning. That's the Thursday morning commute, 530. And then, yeah, you've got the, the idea. Look at the snowfall levels. We've got snowfall levels down to 7,500 feet tomorrow in the mountains. Look at Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Whoa, 4,500 feet on the snow levels this weekend. Now, not a whole lot of moisture, but yeah, along the passes, perhaps see a couple of light uh, snow flurries at times. 50s for overnight the lows tonight, your highs tomorrow with your 70 forecast, mostly low to mid 60s as we go in through Wednesday. Showers pick up later in the evening and those on the weekend. Mark and Joyce, you can see those 50s right through about Sunday.